This is the first out of a series of videos in which you will learn how to create different question types in a test. In this video, we will show you how to create your own multiple choice questions and an error text. In the newly created test, you can produce your first question by pressing Questions from the menu bar. You can either create your own questions or add them from a question pool. I'm going to produce new questions, so I press the Create Question button. In the newly displayed window, you can choose from a wide range of question types. I'll start with a multiple choice question with one correct answer. You need to make sure that you do not use questions from a pool and should leave the field here checked. Then you press Submit. Now you have to give the question a title. I'll call mine Morphological Operations. The author should also be set. You can give a brief description as well. Then you should enter the question itself. For instance, which of the following is a morphological operation? You can also format your questions and answers. I'll make mine bold and bulleted. Then you can set a time limit for this particular question. You can shuffle the answers of the questions. Choose the answer type. Mine will be single line answers. Then you enter the answers. The first one here will be derivation, which is not the correct answer so I'm not going to give it any points. From the small green button here, you can add your next possible answer. Mine will be non-concatenation. And this should be the correct answer, and it should give participants two points if they answer the question correctly. Then you upload each of the answers so that they appear as options in the multiple choice question. I'll add two more answers, so I'll press the green button again. Once the answers are ready, you should press Save and Return to see the changes in your test. The question and the answers are displayed. But if you want to make further changes to the question and the answers, Simply left-click on question and then edit. You can move the question, for example, place it before or after another question in the test and then simply press submit. You can delete the question if you don't like it and if you want to save all changes just press the Finish Editing button. Your multiple choice question is ready. An error text is a text with incorrect terms that students should identify and correct. From the Question Type menu, choose Error Text and press Submit. In the new window, Enter again the title of the question. I'll call mine simply error text. Then enter the question. For example, can you identify the mistakes in the following text? Here is the text itself. Then you should identify the mistakes. 
In this case, this is word formation. If the mistake is more than one word, you can indicate it by placing double brackets before and after the words. If the mistake is one word only, you should only place a hash symbol before it. Then you should press Analyze Error Text. The program identifies the mistakes and enables you to enter the correct words. In this case, these are inflection and inflectional respectively. Then you press Save and Return to view the changes in the test. Your error text is ready. To save the question, press Finish Editing.